Hi, I'm Derek Lobertier with SAP. I'm here at Sapphire Now 2018 in Orlando to check out how SAP's intelligent technology is helping to provide new business value and create new business models. This demonstration shows how the Internet of Things, machine learning, and blockchain can help users deliver better end-to-end -end customer experiences. Many different types of organizations could benefit from SAP Leonardo, but this showcase loosely simulates a car rental company. In this case, I'm driving a remote-controlled ball full of sensors. It represents a rental car. Let's start with what IoT and machine learning can teach us about our customers. As our cars move along our showcase, it maybe bumps a couple of times into the walls, it goes faster, it slows down, and based out of this we can derive what kind of a driver you are. Measure the speed, measure acceleration, collisions, and from there we can see uh, you took a short duration for the ride or a long duration, you're maybe an agile driver or a more relaxed rider. Real-time telemetric data from the car's IoT sensors enable our company to identify different customer categories for which we could use SAP C4 HANA to instantly create new targeted campaigns or determine the best vehicles to buy as we grow our rental fleet. We can also use this data to offer better pricing models to our customers while getting them to help us solve one of our industry's biggest problems. Nobody is gentle with its rental. So what if we could incentivize our customers to use the car as if it were their own cars? So drive more defensively, take care of the engine, ride it, ride it warm properly before going full speed. My risk level increases every time that my car collides with the wall. But my risk level decreases along with my price as I drive more safely. This instantly will bring value to my customer. He pays a better price, but this also brings value to me as a rental car company. I could take this information and prove to my insurance company that my customers treat the cars better and negotiate better fares. And then I can decide what do I do with that. And maybe I want to do that based on customer segmentation. Customer segmentation might not work well on the luxury level, which is not very price sensitive but it could make a tremendous difference to an organization looking to grow aggressively in the budget market. What's more, blockchain can help convey trust and transparency within a significant revenue stream for rental car companies, selling their used rental cars. The problem is nobody wants to buy a rental because we know how we treat it, right? But now that I have proof actually, if I, if I save that actual usage data in the blockchain, where it's transparent, immutable, you cannot mess what's in there. I can show to my buyer how the car has been used of the overall lifespan, resulting in possible opportunities for me as a rental car company. These new opportunities include selling the cars directly to consumers, which could be easier with blockchain's digital ledger showing people exactly how the car has been treated. Cars that have been well cared for could fetch a higher price. There's also the potential for new business services. Imagine this, as a rental car company, you take all this information, you had a couple of hundreds of drivers in that type of car, and you offer the insights of how this car has been used to the car manufacturer for intelligent product design. Car manufacturers could also combine machine learning technology with blockchain data to improve maintenance schedules. Now, if you have actual usage data, how the car has been ridden for the, I don't know, 100,000 mile inspection, you can tell your customer already, hey, I know you just need fresh oil. Your brakes are still fine, your tires are still fine. Overall, the car manufacturer or the services provider could fit more inspections into the same day at the end, resulting in shorter waiting times for the customers, better service, uh, better customer experience, happy customer. But this new technology is about more than having the coolest new gadgets. It must create business value and it must be a must from the very beginning be able to have scalability, feasibility, desirability. Always imagine how can, how can it create new business opportunity for you. That's all for now from Orlando. For SAP, I'm Derek Klobuchar.